All right, Shalom. I'm going to start out by giving all praise and glory unto you. How about Shema Ali Shah by Shema Kakodash? Double honest to the apostle and others of great millstone. Shalom to all that I keep out there pushing the word of sincerity and in truth. Yeah, I just want to do this lesson on judgment of, you know, coming to, you know, you wicked rappers slash niggas, man. You know, you, you, you jakes. You know, these things got to be said because the scriptures speak about, you know, um, prophesying against the wicked of our nation. You know, the ones that basically essentially warlocks. You know, the big boy warlocks in the community, they generate a uh, uh, hell of revenue, you know, from streams. And, and if you listen to their musical content, it's all uh, uh, drug induced, drug induced uh, uh, rap. You know, how many people they shot, how many people they robbed, you know, um, uh, bricks of cocaine, you know, which essentially just sh shatters, just dilapidates and destroys communities cr crack cocaine you know we know when these different drugs actually these street drugs actually hit the uh, black and latino native american vicinities how it just raged through the streets and and people turn into uh dope fiends when, when you look up the origin of dope or, or fiend it me it basically goes into like a ghoul or a demon you know and if you look at a lot of these people that's on these drugs you can see the spirit is just stripped stripped from them so these guys put that life lifestyle in uh, high praises. You know, they praise the lifestyle of 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 doing wickedly by people, you know, def defrauding, robbing, you know, stabbing, killing. As it is written in Hosea 4, there's there's no truth in the land, you know, by lying, stealing, shedding men's blood, you know, and starting these different street gangs where they'll enable the, the youth They'll enable the youth to, um, well, it's, it's, it's Negro terminology, they'll say crash out. Or they'll enable the youth to actually create damn near, uh, 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 com like a kamikaze style act. <laughs> you know, when you kill yourself, you know, for, for, for the benefit of your, um, of your tribe of people. So they'll, they'll get these guys, these young jakes that don't know no better. So to speak about deceiving the uh, hearts of the simple. You know, these simple-minded jakes with a, a, a criminally low IQ, you know, lack of discernment, lack of uh, independence. They don't know how to uh, tell anybody no. They just looking at a man's pockets and they worship him like a demigod, you know, because he has a drip. You know, he has a level of flavor. And then they'll end up doing these different uh, heinous crimes in, in the name of that street gang, man, you know going to shooting in uh, enemy territory which that's control opposition you know and and these guys that uh, are at the top of the pyramid you know these guys are uh, uh, they, they benefit the most you know and see the most I is putting a, a a divinely wicked spirit on these these jakes to to, to uh, not just rap about it but actually you know try to live both worlds you know, rap, try to be a rapper slash a, a street criminal, you know, and, and that's the most I put in that spirit on you guys, man, to the point where they can't even shake that that uh reality and their asses is getting heavily incarcerated. You know, they're getting thrown in prisons for, for you know, a, a innumerable amount of time, so to speak. You know, 50, 50, 55 years, 40 years, 25 years just rotting away. And losing all their assets, assets being basically compromised, you know, through these different lawyer fees and government um, involvements to try to get some type of freedom. You know, so it's, it's a vicious cycle. And these guys are just falling in that pit. They, they're tricking themselves off the street, you know. And um, the, the most, like I said, the most I is judging these guys, man. Because if you, you know, go into the majority of these guys, they don't. You know, they, they might do a few things for the community. Jake, well, well, they gave turkeys on Thursdays. and Yeah, but they, 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 they started street gangs. Like they said, this, this guy, Young Thug in particular, said this guy was, street gang was responsible for a, 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 a large chunk of uh, homicides in Atlanta. You know, and in Atlanta, you know, that, that uh, YSL, his, his, his little street gang, they're very popular, you know. They're very popular all throughout the um, Atlanta region. So the most has, uh, you know, getting back on these different jakes, man. Because these different jakes, you know, they 
they disregard the Lord. They put the Lord on on a back burner, you know. And they, like I said, essentially they're witches, anyways. They really worship Satan, the spiritual demon Satan, and they'll actually show that through their uh, rap rap lyrics how defiant they are. You know, they have the ability to. Excuse me. They have the ability to to leave the um, drug drug game or whatever type of scamming defraud fraud defrauding game that they're involved in and actually live a wholesome lifestyle and uh benefit from that for the for for so-called generations but they choose not to you know and like i said it's all ultimately them being in a trick bag of yahweh by shima and being um you know giving them getting a, enough uh rope to hang themselves and that's why when you see these different uh federal agents all they're doing is is working in the shadows man Watching their online presence, watching their social media presence, you know, um, linking the dots, you know, on the web, you know, that's to 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 net your ass, you know, they they just sew a they just sew a net, and they said that if, if I watched the video with the uh, Atlanta, she she works for the um for the, for the police. I don't know what her actual position is. But she was basically saying that, uh, yeah, social media, social media is our bread and butter. We go to social media to crack majority of these cases. And these so these um, social media has been uh, a very, very benefit, more beneficial to the government than, than you niggas. All right. But see, you Jake's majority of your, your streams and all your, your your money is generated from social media, that social platform, as well as your wicked lifestyle. So you're caught up in the mist, you know, and. Like I said, you're 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 basically being uh, wedged to a certain position where you can't break free from, you know. And like I said, ultimately the Lord is putting you in these situations, and you're getting pawned out by the so-called white man and through his government, man. You know, and that's why the scriptures speak about, you know, worshiping the Lord and worshiping Him in sincerity and in truth, you know, because there is no other option. These guys try to climb up some type of alternative route and think they're gonna have a, a you know, like a Cinderella story. You know, I was a, you know, did X, Y, Z. And at the end of the day, I got to, uh, you know, live, live freely, you know. And then, like I said, they'll, they'll get, uh, you know, blotted out. But I'm going to get some scripts. This is uh, Hosea 4 and uh, 1. Hear the word of the Lord, you children of Israel. For the Lord has a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. Because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of the Most High in the land. By swearing and lying and killing and stealing and committing adultery. Yeah, this is a a a, a nigga starter starter kit, man. Swearing, I swear, bro, I swear on God, on Jesus Christ. It's out on my mama, on folk Jake in California, on folks and them. Jake always got some time, and they be lying through their teeth. That's why you can't. But man, look, that's why Jake in this world, your best option is, is to um. Uh, Dialogue shortly. The scripture says, "When you're amongst the indiscreet, measure the time." You know, you could you could look at certain spirits and be like, "Oh no, nah, this Jake, this Jake, he uh, he's off his rocker." See, and these uh, these rap artists, they'll see a Jake that is uh clearly off of his meds, and they'll enable him. They'll put the biggest gun on on the streets that they could get, and they're gonna put they'll put it on his in his hand, and then put some drugs. In his in in his hand as well. They they put a big ass gun in his right hand, a a, a big, uh, uh uh you know brick of cocaine in his left, you know, and and and, and employ them. They they employ these niggas, man. These jakes that are uh, you know wild. They come from a broken household, fragmented households. You know, father wasn't in their life. You know, and they have a terrible upbringing. They have a terrible sense of discernment. They don't know right from wrong, and they're looking for like a father figure. So these guys make these 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 children, these adolescents and um, youth underlings in their programs, and they essentially sacrifice them, you see, for their benefit. But then when they get put to a certain situation, they're being sacrificed. This is a you know this 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 the life of fish <laughs> doggy. This is a doggy dog world, you know. But by swearing and lying, and killing, and stealing. And committing adultery. All these Jakes rap about is fucking your bitch, fucking your woman, fucking your bitch, fucking your woman, you know. But why isn't it I just have my woman and we just have our sexual engagements? 
because it's not cool to Jake. The scripture says that uh, stolen waters is sweet, man. You know, to, to, to Jake, let me get that. To Jake, if they could take something from you without purchase, they'll have the, they, Jake will have the money. Jake will have more than enough money to actually, um, to actually purchase their own, but they want to take it from you. Because it's a it's a pseudo manhood. It's a it's a pseudo sense of feeling like you you you've done. Uh, 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 that's a pseudo form of masculinity. All right, the Most High didn't create us to to steal. The scriptures speak about. You know, don't get it wrong. It was times that we spoiled nations. You know, and that was our God given right at, at times. Right, shit, all the time, really. When we went into these different nations. We spoiled them, and it was our God-given right. The Most High told us we're gonna go to the land of uh, of the Hamites, all right, and we're gonna we're gonna put in that work. We're gonna we're gonna plunder them. We're gonna be able to take. And there's certain times where the Lord said, "Don't st don't take nothing from them," all right. But see, you Jakes, you're not being uh, spiritually sponsored by the Most High to 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 push his priorities. You guys have your own satanic left hand side program. And you're getting caught up in your own spider web because you don't you don't even see the bigger picture that you're just a little pawn. All right. You're just somebody that's being shooken and moving to the um, and manipulated like uh, from a from a bigger ventriloquist, man. You don't see the ventriloquist because they're in the shadows. All right. But hey, even uh, one of the rappers and I didn't listen to it, but Lil Durk, he had a video where he was actually a puppet. And you see the uh, ventriloquist controlling them, and you can see the strings on them. So these guys are being strung, uh, uh, what's the saying go, strung along. But see, we, Jacob, see, oh, they worth eight million, nine million. They'll think that they're, these guys are, uh, have ascended into, to, uh, Godship. You know, and Esau looks at these guys like, oh, he, he just a little nigga that's, that's relevant for these, for these five, maybe 10 years. After that, we're going to hang them on the, uh, uh, on the gallows, man. And put another Jake that, uh, uh, you know, has the same pool, you know, or same create creative creative nigga methods as him. And we're going to put him in a spot. You see? And we're going to keep these guys incarcerated from that lifestyle. See? And that's why the Most High has to uh, create a hard reset. But this is Proverbs 9 and 17. Stolen waters are sweet. And bread eaten in secret is pleasant. Yeah, see, so Jake want to take something from you and eat it in, in secret, man. That's why the scripture says that such is the way of an adulterous woman. She eateth and, and wipeth her in Proverbs 30 and 20. Matter of fact, I'll, I'll just get it since I'm quoting it and I know where it's at. Proverbs uh, 30 and 20. Such is the way of an adulterous woman. She eateth and wipeth her mouth and saith, I have done no wickedness. Yeah, what is that? Adultery. You see, so these Jakes feel... Uh, uh, you know, they, they get enamored with uh, committing these these atrocious acts, and then they'll put it all throughout their rap lyrics, you know, and, and, and praise that lifestyle. You know, the Most High doesn't subscribe to that lifestyle. So what power? And then they'll speak about God. Yeah, you you you're speaking about God, all right? You do you do worship God? The word God in the Hebrew is a uh, power. You do worship a power. But it's not the power of uh, Yahweh or Yahweh Shah. You see? You worship the spiritual demon Satan, which Satan is a god. You know, the scriptures speak about Satan being the god of this world. If our people are blinded, the god of this world have blinded the minds. And see, the god of this world have created uh, uh, these different warlocks to keep you blind, to keep that veil over your face. But it says they break out and blood touch your blood. Therefore shall the land mourn, and everyone that dwelleth therein shall languish with the beasts of the field and with the fowls of heaven. Yea, the fishes of the sea also shall take away. Yes, yeah, so shall be taken away. So that's uh, indicative of judgment day. All right. When the Lord is going to open the, uh, you know, he's, he's going to open the floodgates of hell, you know. And if you've been. You know, doing denying the Lord, not doing the scripture speak about uh, the first love and going back to the first works. If you haven't been a, a faithful minister and ministering unto the Lord uh, while he's uh, like the scripture speak about Yahweh Shah being on his long journey, he's going to come back and put put, a, a, you know, the burner on you, man. And I'm not talking about a gun I'm talking about 
the uh, the flame from the chariots. It tells you that Isaiah 66 and 15, man. You know, that highly concentrated fire that's going to uh, 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 disintegrate you. Because the Lord's not playing, man. The Lord isn't. The Lord's not on social media in the heavens getting for, getting giggles out of shit, man. You know, like a like you're gonna go to the uh, likes of a video, you're gonna have four million views, and you're gonna see a like. It's gonna be the most highest page, and the, the Lord, the Lord ain't entertained by the fuckery of of, of Jake, man. The Lord, the scriptures, man. I'm gonna get that. The most high is enraged right now, man. All the evil shit that's going on in the world. All this wickedness, all this game playing. Jake always want to play games and to miss the war. We in the, we behind enemy lines, man. Everything ain't about uh, jokes and fun, man. Jake always want to have some damn fun. It, it's times where you you scripture speak about. It's a time to uh you know uh, uh laugh. There's a, there's a time for certain things. You know, don't get it wrong. I laugh. I play. We all are, are you know we're creatures. You know, you're gonna laugh. You're gonna you're gonna have. Hot, you know, you're gonna be sad. You're gonna be happy. You're gonna you're gonna joke. But see, Jake is oversaturated with 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 funny ass jokes, man. Jake just want to be online for seven. They, I seen a video. They said that the average person spends like seven hours on their phone a day. So Jake was want to spend seven to eight hours a day, which is essentially a a, a whole work shift per weekly, a full time work shift, giggling giggling their, uh to their heart's content, sniggling and giggling. You know, while the, while, the, while the man is on top of you creating, put, fin creating something, uh, uh, brewing up something to put the works on, on, on Jake's ass, man. You know, and that's why even us brothers in the faith, you know, we, we got we to gotta stay ten toes down, man. We got to be a cut above the masses, you know. We got to level up, boss up, because this devil, he's not playing on social media, man. He's not going through these funny ass posts all day. They created that social media shit to keep you, Jakes, in your stupidity. Keep you, Jakes, at a base, commoner level, man. You know, snickering and sniggling, you know. Like I said, it's not like I ain't got social media and I don't see things and laugh at times. But on an all-day, all everyday basis, you know, you 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 gotta uh you know you gotta you gotta be settled, man. Let's get you speak about that, man. It says don't even be you know move to and for, fro, man, with the things of the world. You on this platform, you on that platform. And there's one thing: if you on a platform like us, we get on these platforms and 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 do our re research, like, like the CIA, the CIA and the FBI. They use social media just as much as a lot of these 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 jakes. But what they do, they use these social media sites, and they as as a weapon. Or they use it as a um as a method to get their uh uh you know to crack their uh uh you know crack the safe so to speak to gain content accumulate material accumulate data a bridge in the gaps all right they're investigating so when we actually go on these different sites you know it's you know a lot of times it's, it's certain content that you could actually use you know, scripture speak about using the world as not abusing it. All right. So you can use the world. You know, you're going to have times of fun. You know, it's going to have. But fun mainly means to distract. And the most is, is pissed off with this world because it's, it's just overly saturated with just, you know, fun. Jake always want to have some damn fun, man. If the, if Jake is not extreme criminals, they're, they're heavily distracted, man. They're not focused on the on the uh, the mission. Nahum 1 and 2, the Most High is jealous and the Lord revengeth, the Lord revengeth and is furious. Yeah, so the Most High is red hot, man. He's enraged, you know, about the ways of the world. The Lord, when the Lord created, and I always say this, the Lord created the world in 6,000 years. The, the day with the Lord is a thousand years. The first day, six, second day, of course, the seventh day was, was the, you know, the project was finished. All right. But then when he was putting his architectural design and 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 the the uh, angels and the as it is written the Allahayam when they was executing it the Most High said it was good to wab the word good of course is to wab which is perfect splendid pleasant you know the layout when the earth was it was paradise but when that man boy <laughs> when man got in that uh in that that settled there it ran amok and and then how much more the wicked man in these times now 
This world is destroyed, man. It's destroyed to the point where animals don't even want to live here no more. Man doesn't even want to live here. A lot of men don't even want to live on earth no more. You know? So, it was never intended to be such. This was supposed to be an uh, Israelite's paradise. The world, Eden, I done, paradise, pleasure, joy. You know, ultimately, of course, Eden means paradise, but loosely paraphrasing, it means uh, pleasurable. You know, pleasure, pleasure land or some, something to that degree. But uh, it says... Lord will take vengeance on his adversaries and he reserveth wrath for his enemies. Yes, so the Lord is holding back and he's retaining all his wrath for two thirds of you Jakes as well as the uh heathen nations, right? You know, you Jakes don't you know, you're not looking to, to get into the good graces of the most high. You really a lot of you Jakes will give a fuck less about the most high. You know? You've 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 put yourself and propped yourself in a position where you think Nobody can't tell you nothing. So you're going to have to learn the hard way. Like I had put out that uh, layout of all these little rappers. If, you know, if guys in their camp tell them, man, you got to start rapping about this X, Y, Z, man, it's, it's, you know, it's, 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 it's damaging the community. It's damaging the, the minds of the, the youth. You know, these guys ain't going to turn back because what? They got record deals. They're, they're entitled to produce. They're entitled to have sales, you know? So what? They're, they're, um, charged up with uh, put producing uh, sounds of uh, malicious content, you know? And like I said, it's backfiring on a lot of you different jakes. You jakes are not uh, being able to actually get get your rest, your proper rest. A lot of you jakes are addicted to drugs. And a lot of you jakes are already on soldier soul. The scripture says, such is the joy of a hypocrite. Though he gained the world, he shall lose his soul. All you, you, you jakes... Your soul is pretty much already gone. You just an animated corpse. All right. Scripture says, Proverbs 21 and 16, uh, the man that wandereth out of the way of congregation shall remain in the, the man, the, the man that wandereth out of the uh, understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. You Jake's are already dead. You're just corpses, man. Corpses walking, you know. But I just wanted to have this short and sweet, you know, the Lord is judging. You know, we just have to always pray that the Lord uh, extends his mercy you know, and, um, you know, ha has it where we could actually be settled in these, these harsh times, you know, so hopefully brothers will edify. I'm going to end it by giving, and a few sisters that watch, I'm going to end it by giving all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Shema, Shabbat, Shema, Kakodash, double honest of the apostles and elders of the great millstone, Shalom, Amakim.